Hi everyone, I am Cemal Bulunmaz, your jewelry professional and you are here on Bulunmaz YouTube channel. Today we are starting a brand new video series. We will have a check with uh, CNC tools, which tools we can use on CNC machines. And today in this video we will study the most important, the most popular one, CNC line tool. That's a CNC line tool. There is a natural diamond or monocrystal diamond on it. So when the tool engrave on your uh, jewelry products, it will give a bright shine. We have many different sizes of these CNC line tools and we will study each of them in this video. And here is an example of a ring which I used CNC line tools. You can see the figure, the line made with CNC line tool and I have CNC line tools starting from 0.10 up to going up to 2 mm, 3 mm. We will see each of them now. Ladies and gentlemen, we are studying CNC tools and welcome to Bulunmaz again. are using CNC machines or you are planning to get one, CNC line tool will be the most important part of your production. Why most important part? Because CNC line tool has different sizes and it gives you the opportunity to make different figures, different lines, different uh, designs on your rings or bangles. Here I'm holding Bulunmaz tool catalog in my hand and here you can see the most popular CNC line tool sizes. It's starting from 0.10 going up to 3 mm and most popular tools will be 0 0.10, 20, 30, 50 and 1 mm which we will see in this video now. You can always have a look at our CNC line tool models in our website or you can download our PDF catalog also on our website. And now you can also study our tools with videos and with uh, different figures and even you can shop online on www.bodonmas.com Please have a check if you have time. I will use three tools in this video, 0.10 mm CNC line tool, that's the thinnest size. We can even make thinner sizes if you order, we can make like 0.05, but our standard sizes start from 0.10. So why I choose this tool to start, because that's one of the most popular size on a ring. And I will uh, make a figure, as you can see here, it's a, a detailed figure, so 0.10 tool, 0.10 mm tool will be enough to engrave that figure on my ring. Everything is ready to start. I'm using Ringmaker CNC machine. It's a 4X CNC machine. If you wanna learn more about it, you can have a look at our YouTube channel for more videos. There are many detailed videos. Everything is ready. My tool is fixed and my model is done. And I'm starting the operation. Now the machine will go and engrave that great detailed figure on my ring with a 0.10 millimeter line tool. Here the operation starts and it will take a quick time, it will not take long time. Here you can see the machine is engraving. Ringmaker has a 4-axis controller, 4-axis uh, movement. There are six heads inside. You will see in this video series I will be using Ringmaker many more uh, places, many more models, so you will know more about it later. Ringmaker completed the operation. It took only one minute. I used, uh, I passed two times over the ring because I wanted to cut deep and to cut clean. So two times were good. Even I cut two times. It took only one minute in Ringmaker. So my ring is ready. I will just don't forget to clean your ring. I will just take out, and here is the result. First result of our video of CNC line tool. Let's see what it's used for. You can see on it, there is a design pattern, which I designed previously before. And I use, uh, of course, CNC line tools are made of diamond, natural or monocrystal diamond, depending on the request of customer or depending on the production lot, it depends on time. But still above uh, qualities, monocrystal or natural diamond give a shine on the rings. I completed 0.10 mm CNC line tool, you saw the effect. Now I will change my tool to 0.5 mm, which means 0.50 mm. 
Why I change it? Uh, it's a, also a popular size. I wanna show you the difference of 0 0.10 and 0 0.50. I will change my tool and later I will choose a less detailed model on the uh, on my model bank. Ringmaker has 2,000 models inside. Don't forget it. So I will choose a less detailed model on my model model bank, uh, which is convenient for 0 0.5 millimeter, and I will start the operation. I just set 0.50 millimeter uh, CNC line tool on Ringmaker. It's a really quick process. You just change. That's a manual tool change spindle. You just unscrew it. You put the tool and you screw. Then you have to set the zero to the machine. But don't worry. To set zero is like a, uh, there is a sensor, so the machine is making itself. That's the 0.50 millimeter tool I will use in this video. My model is here. The next model, and let's start the operation. See how it will look like. Last shot was the bonus of this video, little snowflakes effect. I like such effect. So I'm taking out my ring. You don't forget to put uh, oil, uh, to clean your ring. Normally it's better to clean over there. I just forget it. So here is my uh, final ring wheel with 0 0.50 millimeter CNC line tool. As you can see, the effect is uh, bigger. I will show you all the rings end of the video all together. We use first 0 0.10 mm and second uh, 0 0.50 mm size. These are the sizes we use mostly in wedding bands, wedding rings. Because why? It's a small size. 0 0.10, 20, 30, 40 and 50 mm are perfect sizes for your uh, wedding rings, wedding ring production. Don't forget to visit our website www.bulomas.com to check and to buy online now you can buy online your tools don't forget as a last tool i will use one millimeter cnc line tool you can use this tool on wedding bands or uh, bangles also because the size is pretty big so my model is limited i cannot make a very detailed model on uh, with one millimeter cnc line tool so i will change my tool now choose my model and start the operation for the last time in this video I fixed my 1mm CNC line tool and I fixed a, a new, brand new empty ring so I will start the operation soon. I want to show you again how CNC line tools look like. Here is the diamond of my CNC line tool. As I told you that's natural diamond or monocrystal diamond depend on the our production, depend on your request. Here is written the 1.0mm line, the size of the tool. And here you will see our brand Bloom Mask. Don't forget to check that brand, brand logo. And that's a cover of the tool. When you send us back the tool to repair, we can take out the cover and repair your tool. And that's the shank part. Shank is six millimeter. We can also make different shank sizes depending on your orders. I choose a much simple design because the size is one millimeter. As you know, I cannot engrave so much detail. I choose such a, a simple design to make on my ring. And I'm starting the operation. That's the, the really easy controller software of Ringmaker. It starts and it will take a really quick because my simple is simple, simple, and my design is simple, and the tool is big. It will engrave really quick. That was a quick operation. We completed our ring with one millimeter CNC line tool. Don't forget to clean, so you will see the result. You can see the you can see the line size increased a lot. That's one millimeter line size. You get bigger line size. You can engrave much faster, but of course the details will decrease if you especially produce bangles this one millimeter or above one millimeter like 1.5 two millimeter will be much better option for you 
I use three tools in this video, 0 0.10, 0 0.50 and one millimeter. I'm holding three sides so you can see the difference much better now. Here again, you see the different tools, different sizes, CNC line tools. You can see the difference much better and you can understand, you can visualize the result of each tool much better in these samples. If you like our models, if you want to see more of our models, just have a look at our Bullion Mask Tools Instagram account. You will find lots of different models, different uh, variety of tools, combinations. So you will get, you will collect many different ideas in our Instagram account. If you want to know more about me, myself, just have a look at my Instagram account below. You can see to learn about my travels, my life, my uh, time in the company. Just have a look. We have different CNC tools in different forms, not just line tools. We also have point, ball, circle, lining and many other tools. We prepared that video series, each video explaining about this and you can find, you can click the descriptions of this video below to find the links of these videos. Thank you so much for watching our video. I hope you are enjoying our YouTube channel. You are learning new things about your jewelry production. So see you again in the next video. Take care of yourself.